Currently in the world, all of the written material is divided into two big buckets. There's the content that's designed for the web, and then there's content that's designed for print, which usually has text on a fixed layout on a page. So we realized that there is an opportunity to dramatically lower the barriers to publishing and to make it easy for anyone to publish their writing to the web and find an immediate readership. What Scrib does is it takes that content designed for print and it merges it with the web. This is really the first time in history where people are reading in a social way. People are reading on digital devices, they're reading on mobile devices. Because of the way people are more instinctively sharing these days, people are now not just reading, but they're sharing what they're reading. And, and with Scrib, we're making it easier for people to do this. People find Scrib documents in all kinds of ways, like through links on Facebook and Twitter, search results on search engines like Google, recommendations from friends and colleagues, embeds on blogs and new sites, or by browsing the site. The fact that we can now turn documents and written works into HTML5 web pages with the exact original formatting and the exact same look and feel is, uh, is a really big idea for the world because it really changes the nature of what a document or written work is. Rather than tying our content to a specific device in a proprietary format. We use all open standards format so that everything published to Scribd is readable on any computer, tablet, e-reader, or mobile phone. Scribd is being recognized as a technology pioneer because we're at the, the forefront of how reading is changing and part of that transformation of, of reading to a digital experience. One of the great things about Scrib is our ability to connect people. There are a lot of micro-communities within Scrib of people with similar interests who have found each other through work published at the site. Today, everyone from individual teachers and authors to Fortune 500 companies and large global organizations are using Scrib as their publishing platform. For example, the Red Cross is a Scrib user, and when there was a, a terrible earthquake in Haiti, the Red Cross immediately began to use Scrib to publish relevant information. They published photos, they published locations of first aid stations throughout Haiti, they published lists of needed materials, and they published guides to how to find missing persons in Haiti. I don't think anyone who starts an internet company like Scrib really expects it to have such a big impact. You, you always hope it does, but then it's, uh, it's, it's really a great feeling when, when, when you know that what you built is helping to change the world. Forms of media such as music and video have, have gone digital in the last few years and this is really increasing the consumption of those forms of media and we don't want reading to be left behind. While the web today is large, I think the amount of content not yet published on the web far exceeds the amount of content that is on the web. Our goal is to take that content, the content that's not yet on the web, and make it online and open and accessible to everyone.